for the biggest game of the season. We are back with the match day vlogs. Biggest game of the season for Brisbane Raw. A do or die clash with the Newcastle Jets. Who are on a bit of form beating Sydney FC with that massive victory last week. But can the Brisbane Raw push themselves towards finals with two games to go after this? Let's find out. Let's get on the train and get down to the stadium. We're at the stadium. Very interesting squad selections from Brisbane. They bought in Hingott, so they've got Burke Gurry, Hingott, Brown, Truen, and Aldred all playing at the same time. So, could we see a five back from Brisbane? Could we see Burke Gilroy push up a bit higher? Maybe play as a winger, maybe play as a defensive midfielder. Who knows? It's going to be very interesting to see what Ruben Zadkovic does with this team against this Newcastle team that's missing some key players in Moragas and Nata, obviously away with the Oli Roos. Obviously, Brisbane have also lost Yelichich to the Oli Roos, but going to be very interesting to see how Brisbane set up in this one. <laughs> Underway in this game. Brisbane attacking the opposite end to me. That's apparently where they score all their first minute goals. So um, let's hopefully see an early one today as well. In terms of formation wise for Brisbane, it looks like Gilroy has gone onto like a right winger role. So to be interesting to see how he does. And um, I'm sure if he's not doing great by half time, but we'll see Majok pretty early in the second half. But here's Hall, plays it out to Hengert. Here's Hall again. Hits it, and it's well blocked by the Newcastle player. Pretty decent turnout here at Suncall. It's the first time I've been here since that um, amazing win against Melbourne City where they absolutely played them off the pitch. But um, pretty good turnout. It, obviously, it's a Saturday. That's going to help the attendance. And um, it is school holidays, I think. It's still school holidays up here. I couldn't tell you. But um, it's good attendance regardless, which is good to see. ingo has got some space out here on the right-hand side. Taking on Clayton Taylor, and it's a corner for Brisbane. Corner 12 minutes in. Can they make something out of this with a decent Berenguer cross by the looks of it? No, Corey Brown looks like he's going over to take it. After a bit of push and shove in the box, here's Corey Brown with the ball. It's way too deep. Way too deep. And Newcastle have a chance to counter, but it's well cut out there by Beck Gilroy. O'Shea plays. Oh! Woodingham almost gets on the end of that, but it's kept out by Ryan Scott. Corner for Newcastle, Wilmering over it. Deep corner towards Jenkinson, who gets a shot. Oh my god. Fell to Piscovo, but it's kept out by Macklin Freak. Macklin Freak in some insane form at the moment. Keeping it out of the back of the net there early. Corey Brown down the left, plays it back to Jay O'Shea. Can he have a crack from here, Jay O'Shea? It's a good cross, and it's cut out well there by, I believe it's Kanka. Inga down the right, can he find a ball into the box? He cuts in on his left. It's cleared there by Carl Jenkinson. Still in there for Brisbane, and it's cut out again by Newcastle. But one back again by Brisbane, here's Gamulka. He has a shot. Well saved by Ryan Scott, straight at him, but had a bit of power behind that one. Wilmering with an early ball for Newcastle. Comes all the way out to Steins. Plays it back to Piscopo. He's driving into the box, Piscopo plays the 1 2. It's well defended there by Corey Brown. Here's Burke Gilroy down the right. He's, he's just sizing up Wilmering. Oh, Ken Carl looks like actually. Here's O'Shea in the box. Left foot from O'Shea. We're looking. Berenguer. Oh, Brisbane just need to take a shot here. Hall, he's messed it up, Hall. And it's already out from a corner. Very, Brisbane are complaining for a penalty. Adam Kersey's given a corner. Uh, it's going to be interesting to see if anything comes from this. Looks like nothing more is coming from it. And it's a J. O'Shea corner. It's a good ball by O'Shea, but it's... Right in the middle of no one in the middle there for Brisbane. Here's Aldred. Oh, my Lord. That would have been a wonder goal by Aldred. Balls won it back. Here's Berenguer. Berenguer trips over the ball. Uh, he's still got it, Berenguer. Paul's got it now. They're just flying around the edge of the box, Brisbane. 
O'Shea plays a 1-2 with Wanniam. Oh! Touch is a bit too heavy from O'Shea, but Brisbane just need to take some shots, man. Like, they're in such good positions, they just can't, they're just not shooting. So, they, you know, what chance do you have when you don't shoot? Wanniam's got the ball in the box here. Brisbane, taken away by Newcastle, but it's gone straight to Corey Brown. He's run down the byline here, Corey Brown. Oh my lord! What a block off the line! Dan Wilmering with... I don't think he knew what actually happened. Let's have a look at the replay here. Corey Brown runs down the line. Burke Gorey gets a touch on it. Oh my lord! That is an all-time goal line clearance from Dan Wilmery. All for Brisbane. Oh, deflection! Oh my lord! The deflection off Kankar takes it just wide. Ryan Scott was absolutely rooted to the spot. But Brisbane have picked up another corner here. They're starting to take these chances, Brisbane. Something's going to come for them soon. Here's O'Shea with the corner. Good corner. A bit too deep, though. It's going to be kept in here by, it looks like, Truins up there. Can Hinga put a ball in here? Right, they're trying to work it back out to O'Shea. And it's well cut out there by Daniel Stones. O'Shea's found Berenguer, who plays at Corey Brown on the left-hand side. Good cross by Brown. Oh, just over Berkeley and Hall. Oh my god, how's it not gone in? How's it not gone in? They've shot side to side. Someone's been called for offside here. I don't know how the ball didn't end up in the back of the net. That's crazy. I think I've just seen one of the funniest yellow cards I've ever seen. The ball's still in play. I think Brisbane wants one of their players to change their boots. And Zankovic has just kicked the ball onto the field. It's the funniest thing I think I've ever seen. 38th minute here in Brisbane. Dylan Tom Beatties. It's a foundation game for him. Everyone's standing around clapping. Good, good causes here in Brisbane. Good causes. It's got heaps of space down in the right-hand side. Can he put in an early delivery? Pondered on it too much, Hingit. It's hit about three different people when Ryan Scott's picked the ball up. Just need those earlier deliveries, I think, for Brisbane. Like, they're getting the bodies in the ball, their box. They're just, you know, not providing to them. Hingit on the right here again for Brisbane. Getting a lot of action down this side, Hingit. He's got a corner. We're in stoppage time now. Hopefully, for Brisbane's sake, something happens. Hopefully for my sake something happens. It's been a pretty dull first half. Not much has come in the way of chances. Brisbane have had the majority of the ball, just not creating much. Newcastle's not doing a whole lot with it when they get it. Um, but shout out to the Newcastle faithful. They have turned up in some pretty good numbers today. Probably about 50, 50 to 100 odd of them. Pretty good numbers. Here's O'Shea with the corner. Decent corner. Put in way too deep for Tommy Aldred. There we go, half time. Like I said, very um, very dull affair at half time. Nil all. Yeah, hopefully the second half. Some more goals. Hopefully I get to see more goals. They'll become Brisbane will attacking me in the second half. So um, hopefully I'm hoping for goals. I'm hoping for goals. Please give me goals. We might be watching one of the greatest half time entertainments I've ever seen. Toddler football racing. That might just be one of the greatest halftime entertainments I've seen in a long time. <laughs> Second half underway. Just hoping for some more action in this game. It wasn't a whole lot in the first half. Just hoping for a bit more. You know, this game deserves it. It's a big game for Brisbane. And Newcastle just want to hold out, probably for an ill or a draw. Try and ruin Brisbane chances of a of a finals berth, but you know. I'm I'm sure Brisbane will come up with something during the second half. Early kick, oh, free kick from O'Shea. It's gone deep towards four and it's blocked by Sama. Goes through for a corner for Brisbane though. Short corner from O'Shea to four. Play back to four, but he's definitely offside. Silly, silly from Brisbane. What a waste. Engert, low cross, 
claimed by Scott once again. The man on a mission, Ryan Scott. Clayton Taylor for the Jets with a shot. Oh, what a goal from Clayton Taylor. What a goal from Clayton Taylor. Just out of nothing. They've had no chances, Newcastle. He just swivels in the box and takes the shot. It's just poor defending from Brisbane once again. Just letting him, allowing him to get onto his stronger foot and take that shot. But yeah, wow. Clayton Taylor has absolutely silenced this Brisbane crowd. And the Newcastle fans in the opposite corner are going absolutely crazy. Newcastle on the attack again. Oh, great cut out there by Gamulga. But um, Newcastle have worked their way into this game. They've been they've been poor the second half so far this season, but the last couple of weeks have been really good in the second half. So Brisbane need to rally or else their finals hopes are absolutely in the bin. And with a shot, just over the bar. Absolutely just thought I was recording to be completely honest. Good build up by my Truen and Berenguer takes a shot and it's just over the bar. His haul down the left for Brisbane. Cuts into Berenguer, plays it out to Corey Brown. Good first time delivery. And I thought that was a corner. I thought that was a corner. I didn't think it came off Mykowski there, but it's a corner. Now I think there's a VAR check here. I think something happened between Corey Brown and um, young Lockie Bayless, but I'm not 100% sure what happened there. I'm just waiting on a VAR check, I'm guessing. Nothing happened from the VAR check. Brisbane are ready to pounce on this ball that's been played short here by Ryan Scott. Newcastle have played their way out of it well. I think it goes in to the book. Newcastle with a free kick. Grosos and Wilmering standing over it. Looks like Grosos is going to take. It's a good header and it's another goal for Newcastle. Big upset here in Suncorp Stadium. It's a beautiful ball by Costa Grosos. I think it's Stamatolopoulos that's got his head on the end of it. It is Stamatolopoulos. I think that's his 14th of the season now, Stammer. Still going for that golden boot and Newcastle, you know, they don't want to end their season low. Obviously, everything happening around the club at the moment, they want to finish it on a high and, you know, they're going the right way about it at the moment. Plays one to Berenguer. Well blocked by Wilmering as the corner for Brisbane. They need to start mounting something now. We've got about 35 minutes left. And, oh, oh, sorry, about 25 minutes left, sorry. They just need something now, Brisbane. Corey Brown, on the Corey Brown on the corner. Can he deliver a good ball? It's a decent ball. Berenguer just flicks it over the crossbar though. Switch here. Lofthouse is on the ball on the left hand side. Takes on Ingham. Goes inside. It's blocked. Berenguer with the shot. Blocked again. Newcastle scrambling very really well in defence here. But Brisbane have won it back. He's O'Shea. Just goes past Markovsky, but it's called cool offside anyway. Berenguer on the right here for Brisbane. It's very well defended by Newcastle, but it still comes to Mila Ilsnich. Well cleared by Kankalo. Brisbane starting to put on the pressure, but I think it's a bit too late now. And Aldridge just being dispossessed by Stammer Talopoulos. It's Stammer versus Truen, and he's played over Piscopo. Piscopo and Aldridge somehow made up for it with a basically 50 minute dash down the other end and the old boy Tom Aldridge gets Renault Piscopo on this occasion. Newcastle again, Clayton Taylor, he's trying to cook here Clayton Taylor. Good ball in by Wilmering, headed back at the back pose and Samatolopoulos has kicked a field goal. <laughs> Jets are coming at Roar again here, Archie Goodwin, right hand side. Goes past everyone though. Brisbane can break if they're quick enough here. Paul's got the ball down the right hand side. Paul's still running with the ball. Plays it to Miliusnich. Plays it to Berenguer. Back to Miliusnich. And Paul, after running the length of the field, Miliusnich has expected him to go run after that. So it's Interesting decision making by Brisbane in the final third. Again, as we've seen it all season. 
Jones missed one of the great saves. Markovsky has absolutely got on the end of the cross there and he's headed at bottom corner and somehow Ryan Scott, as he's done all season, keeps it out of the back of the net. I don't know how it's happened. There was a top save by Ryan Scott. Ryan Scott has just made an absolutely unbelievable save again. Kai Truins put the ball on target after a little scramble in the box and somehow Ryan Scott, after being on the ground, got up. There's another corner for Brisbane. O'Shea puts it way too deep though. 10 minutes for Brisbane to find something here. Miller just switched down the right. It's a low ball into the box. It's cleared again by Callum Timmons, who hey, has been pretty good today, Timmons. Newcastle's been really solid in defence, something that we haven't been able to say in most of the season. But they've, they've looked really good today in a do I do a game against Brisbane for you know Brisbane's finals hopes. I think they're down the drain at the moment. Here's O'Shea. Shot. Might have been a hand in there. Brisbane still got it though. Here's Miliusnich. Shot by Miliusnich. Oh! Ryan Scott's dived on it. Markovsky's had another dip, nip at it and everything's happening at the moment. This game's getting really crazy. It's Henry Hall trying to create something. Plays Aldred who's gone up forward. Miliusnich plays deep ball in. Corey Brown's still got it. Still around the edge of the box here for Brisbane. Berenger has it. Truen trying to create something. He's the furthest player forward and he's just about 30 yards out. Berenger and Corey Brown play a couple of one-twos between him. O'Shea goes between the legs of Timmons. O'Shea still with the ball. Corey Brown with the shot. Straight at Ryan Scott. This game's getting really end-to-end -end now. Once just dicked it off. Tom Aldred here. He squares it to Stamatolopoulos. There's a good goal line clearance there by Kai Truen. Newcastle had a chance there to make it 3-0. Absolutely fluffed it there. They still could make it 3-0 here. Here's Wilmering. In the box. And he's called for offside anyway. But Newcastle somehow still look like more likely to score after Brisbane having majority of possession and shots in this game. Somehow, New Newcastle just more clinical. That's, that's the only... The only way to put it, Brisbane just haven't been good enough tonight. Corey Brown with a ball in, cleared by Carl Jenkinson. Ooh, again, the Newcastle defenders had a good game today. But just about to run out of time here for Brisbane. Still not creating any decent chances, really. Corey Brown goes down the left, plays Miller, which I think's offside, plays at the four. Newcastle walk away with the ball anyway. Lofthouse down the left for Brisbane, taking on Ingham. I think he's running out of play anyway. He has a goal kick here for Newcastle again. There we go, full time. Newcastle get a 2 0 win. There goes Brisbane's finals hopes out the door, unless somehow, by a miracle, they get another weekend like last weekend where everything goes their way. Ryan Scott with an amazing game and it's well deserved for these Newcastle fans that are travelling at the moment. You know, they might not have a club next season, but they're showing out for their final few games and um, they want to make the most of it if it is their last season. But there we have it. That is the end of this vlog. Only one more to go in the season if Brisbane obviously don't make finals. But even if they do make finals, they still need to make the semi-final for me to be able to catch another game. But... There we go. That is it from this game. Newcastle Jets get up 2-0 over Brisbane Raw. Next game is, of course, the final game of the season. Adelaide United taking on Brisbane Raw. Nestori Irinkunda's final game in the A-League. Should be an absolutely packed house. Can't wait for it. And I will see you then. Until next time, I'll see you soon.